everybody, this is Toy Gamer Junkie, I want to welcome you all back to my channel. So I know Life is Strange itch issue 7 comes out tomorrow, so until then I thought I might read the next volume of Assassin's Creed, because I finished the three volumes, which were um, with Charlotte de la Cruz, you know, they were Trial by Fire, and that was volume 1, I forget what the other two are called. But this volume here continues off that, called Assassin's Creed Uprising. And this this comic series has Desmond's son and Juno and goes on about the Phoenix Project. Now I I haven't read the comic, but I've I've mentioned previously that I know bits and pieces of what happens, but I don't know how and why. Alright, so let's get started. Assassin's Creed Uprising, Common Ground. Loading memory yeah. Here we go. Charlotte, can you hear me? The drones have lost visual. All of them. Why can I hear screaming? Shit, Galena said... Oh, sorry. Shit, Galena said this would be a routine raid. The Templars were supposed to have cleared out weeks ago. Charlotte, don't be dead. Guarnica... Sorry. Guarnica, can you hear me? We were attacked. Charlotte, you're alive. Who's that eating an apple? Listen, they are not Templars. They are like us. What the hell are they? There's a Chinese fire dragon in the sky. Is that going to be a firework or something? Like us? How are they like us? I think they are fucking assassins. Name, Charlotte de la Cruz. Occupation, assassin. Nationality, American. Trivia. Just broke three ribs after being repeatedly stabbed and falling from a 30th floor window. Is not enjoying her first trip to Hong Kong. Uh oh. Assassin. Yeah, she just missed that. Name. Wanika. Wanika. How do you say it? How do you pronounce that? Guarnica? Guarnica? Or something? Guarnica Monio. Occupation. A rototope hacker slash assassin field techie. Reluctant. Nationality, Spanish. Trivia, currently wondering what possessed him to think he, he needed more excitement in his life. Shink. Nope. Drive, dammit. The others, dead move. Al Aboil Lita Tenayas Razan. They're assassins, alright. Oh, come on. Yeah, that's nice, Hong Kong. I love the armor. Ugh. How can they... We are doing 50 miles per hour for the love of... Oh. Off. Off me, you son of a bitch. Gah! Oh, what happened to him? What did he get hit with? Oh, he lost his fingers. Shit. Um, you can see it right there. They sliced off two of his fingers. Crack. Crack. Uh oh, that's not good. Bajami Lita Sabas Que No Puedro Subir Ahi Amor Tendres Que Saltor and Miss Brazos. No Bajami. Granny, get me down. You know I can't climb up there, honey. You have to jump into my arms. No, get me down. T Atrapari T Lo Prometo. I'll catch you, I promise. Ugh, Lita. Nah, hardly. Uh oh. Cabron. Ah! Oh, she break his arm? No, she broke his hand right there. Oh, and now it's loading. Ah, uh, sorry about this. This takes a while for it to load there. So if I just go back and then go forward, this should speed things up. Nope. Okay then. Just gonna refresh it. Here we go, here we go. So we were there, and now we're here. Now, what the fuck are you meant to be? Who's that boy with you up there? Nothing is real. You know who I am, what I am. I'm Todd Stodard, Master Assassin. 
I'm here, I'm Stardot, Creed Breaker, I'm Quilla, the fastest damn Chasky in the Inca Empire. I'm 23, going on 600, which means I've learned a few things. For example, about 8 different ways to girl the man without him losing consciousness. L leave him, we need to go, not without answers. Char, I hear sirens, this won't take long. Uh, okay. But n ne neither does hemorrhage shock. Shit, no. Don't fall asleep, Guanica. You can't. God, can you hear me? No. You hear me? Yeah, don't fall asleep, Guanica. Guanica. You hear me? London, England. Yes. Sick, that was peak fires. What? Yeah. In it being on that cat leap for time blood. You go, Shannon. Nah, mate. Shan won't jump. Girl's a victim. Hush up off, Alex. Fronten like you's a bad man. What? Victim, cuz? Why, get me. Patui. Ye. Back up, bruh. I know what bruh means, though. Oh, Shan Wagwan. Oh, my days. Don't let me catch your breath. Roll and turn into defensive stance. Name Michelle Lamar. Profession Exerodit of Hacker slash trainee assassin. Nationality American trivia. Broke Andy Hillman's arm in two places back in middle school for calling her mama bad word. Yeah. Don't you dare go easy on me, hidden blade. Girl, are you fucking nuts? Now, Galena Voronia, Master Assassin, Russian, once killed three Templar agents with the same scented candle, Mandarin and Cranberry. Oh, nice. That's just... Good watch out for that Cranberry. It's deadly. I have to say I'm impressed. By what? The Arotito Girl's rapacious appetite for punishment? Ouch. I'm not being uncharitable, Scott. Name Kiyoshi Takakura, profession assassin, nationality Japanese, member of the Yakuza's on Morakai Gumi assassin cell, master swordsman, enjoys con Confuci Confucianism and Texas barbecue. Scott Cunningham, uh, Rand is is also fine. Name Arend Scott Cunningham. Profession, assassin, nationality, Dutch, trivia, former MMA champion, husband of fellow assassin, Harlan Cunningham. Got a problem with that? I don't have a problem with that. People's sexual preferences are their own thing. You do what you want, Cunningham. I don't care. As long as you're a good person. Scott Cunningham apologize. I mean, apologies. Look, Arend, there's a new world out there and we need to adapt. This Erotito girl should be on a laptop, not a rooftop. Oof. You might be right, but it has to be her choice, no? If it helps, I would say Galena's doing her very best to dissuade her. Uh, uh, can't breathe. Sloppy, dangerously sloppy. Your block's weak, slow. I saw your attacks coming back when I was in kindergarten. You should be ashamed. <sighs> <sighs> Look at me when I'm talking to you. There's no place for you here. None of my team. Ugh. No. What do you... Snap. Oh, she broke the hidden blade. S nah, I guess that's a new mini for... Oh, snap. She's a good kid. She'll do just fine. It's Stella Cruz. Her Hong Kong op with Barendra Mitra's cell must be over by now. I appreciate your enthusiasm, Dela Cruz. Did you find grammatic, grammatis, grammatis, gra, uh, grammatica? Sorry about that. No, listen to me. Kiyoshi, the op went bad. Okay, like biblical fucking bad. What's your status? Did you manage to retrieve anything on the Phoenix Project? They're dead, okay? The whole team. I barely kept my vital organs and my head in the same zip code. Verdomi. Quanica's go gonna make it, but it's just us. We 
we've gone as dark as we can here, but we still need extraction. We'll get you, but first tell us what happened. The intel was garbage, Galena. They were guarding that place like a... Like an ancient curse or something. They had they had a boy with him, and he and he said, "Oh, it's you. Hello again." Said what? What boy? Who had him? Templars, Sigma team. So that's Desmond's son there. But I think it might be, it could be Aita possibly. But um, in the game I just played, we saw that Aita's eyes, the left, the the left one. That they were opposite colors. On on the left was red and on the right was blue, I believe. I don't know, Galena. I just don't know anymore. Thirty floors, impressive, even by their standards. You admire them. I respect them, Violet. I re sorry. I respect them, Violet. I also respect antibiotic resistance gonorrhea. Okay then. Name, Wani Ostoberg. Profession, Master Templar, Abstergo Industries Operative, and guy who became paralyzed by Layla Hassan in Assassin's Creed Episode 3, Fate of Atlantis. Uh, nationality finished, trivia, recruited by Abstergo who saved his daughter's life, serves them as a member of the Inner Sanctum by day, secretly boots out corruption in the Templar Order as the new Black Cross by night. Name, Violet Da Costa. Templar agent slash Obstergo Industries op operative, nationality Canadian, trivia. What's that say? A Serbic master technician, security specialist, and trusted colleague of Ostoberg. Secretly a high-ranking double agent working for the instruments of the first will. That's right, and she's trying to get Juno back in the power. If you remember what happened at the end of Syndicate, you'll know. You know what I'm talking about. Any idea what happened here? Not really. They cut our cameras during the raid, and the one security officer assigned to this place was just found garroted in his bathtub. The Dragon Boat Festival was yesterday, so most workers stayed home. Meaning no eyewitnesses? Meaning no eyewitnesses. Far as we can make out, they weren't expecting any resistance, so they tried to fight their way out and torched the joint in the process. Which begs the question, why did they encounter resistance? This hasn't been a Phoenix Project lab for months, it is just an archive, right? This place looks like it was defended by a small army. Perhaps the assassins turned on each other. It's happened before. Mid-mission. Not even assassins are that lacking in discipline. Did they get hold of some- hold of anything? Nothing usable. A partial list of pieces of Eden they already know about. No locations. Vermin are extremely resourceful, Violet. They can easily make a banquet from our scraps. Don't you think you are being a little paranoid? It's my job to be paranoid. Yours too, in case you've forgotten. Look at those guys. They're terrified over there. Dot, dot, dot. Why are the police here? Did you remember to transfer the money? I did, but that only buys you breathing room over here. Pasca. Okay, tell them we'll pay off their mortgages if they if if they piss off until tomorrow morning. And what makes you think I can speak uh Cantonese, please? Just reminding you how much you rely on me. Noted, I'm going back to my hotel room to drink to drink Ag Akva was it? Akvavit until my body forgets how to breathe. Call me when you have something for me to kill. Who's that? Uh, yeah, that's Berg. And he's just strolling around. Well, hello, beautiful. Where on earth did you come from, hmm? Name, Ho Hwani Ostoberg. Threat level, Neil. Authorized you start, Y slash N dot dot Y. Oh. Get rid of that as well. Losers, weepers. Okay then. Hmm, not bad, not bad at all. Osto, hello Andre, the earpiece is working then. Hang on, I'm trying something. What do you see? What you see, I'm guessing how, I'm guessing how'd you do that? 
someone very carelessly left a, left a, a pair of Abstergo Skunk Works Division 350,000 prototype military goggles near the scene of, a, of the assassin raid. I cannot, oh, pardon me, I cannibalize them to improve my own. Ah, oh, are Abstergo generally in the habit of leaving classified tech just lying around? What do you think? No, they're not. They probably hacked it or something. How's the rest of the new Black Cross gear? Exquisite? A slight step up from what your ancestors wore, I'll wager. I'll wager. So you thought you'd take it out for a rooftop jot? I need to wear it in and I need a proper look at what lab, uh, at that lab without so many eyes on me. You no, you no longer trust your own people? I barely trust myself, Andre. Yet you trust me with this, and I don't believe, and I don't think I believe in this new world order of yours. And that, my friend, is precisely why I trust you to keep me cul culpable. Now be quiet, I have to concentrate. Let's see. Vic one, Vic 1 died first. Obstergo security bolt, standard issue, crossbow. Usually good aim for a guard. Could have been bad luck. Vic 2, snapped neck, nasty, efficient. Swept to the ground and finished off, finished off with boot, presumably. Not an amateur move by any stretch of the imagination. Vic 3, severed car... car Carotid blood splatter on war consistent high in red for assassin hidden blade lends credence to Violet's theory of skirmish amongst assassin seal. Still not buying it at all. And someone was chased out of that window. How many temples could make a jump like that? Osto? Hmm? Felicia in my unit back in Nami Reeves, nice fellow, Midwestern, used to go on and on about his girl back home in some rust belt town. They'd married a week before he lit lit out on his first tour. Needless to say, he left her with a bun in the oven. I'm trying to focus, Andre. Pay attention. One night he's on watch and he's looking at her picture instead of instead of out into the jungle. Doesn't see the ambush coming till he took a 39mm round in the neck, clipped his... Oh wait, sorry. Didn't see the ambush coming till he took a 39mm round in the neck, clipped his car carotid. I was woke by what felt like heavy rain on my face, only it didn't smell like it. It smelled like loose change. 18 Americans died that night, but somehow Reeves managed to clamp the artery with his own fingers and survived. What did he have to say for himself? Not much in the morning. We pinned his arms behind his back and let him bleed out. You never take your eyes off the tree line, friend. There should be a lot more blood. The wound was cauterized. The blade superheated. Assassin weapon. Obstergo tech? You think assassins and Templars might be working together? I don't know, Andre. All I know is that it's time to shake a few trees. Or else tear them up by the root. Sequence 2. Obsogo Entertainment World HQ Montreal Quebec. You've got that look. <laughs> Half of my face is scar tissue violet. That look is ever present. Don't deflect. You know what I mean. You're picking at it. That bloodbath in Hong Kong. And you're not. I can buy the assassins being there, they could have been working off old intel, but they encountered a vastly superior force in a glorified filing cabinet. That makes no sense. Then again, not much makes sense these days. Did you ask Grammatica about it? Of course. Uh, sorry about that, I had to yawn. A bit tired, but I'm going to get through this comic. Of course. He was quite cooperative once the steam stopped coming out of his ears. And, don't leave me in suspense, and he, swore and he swore blind that he definitely didn't leave the four horsemen of the apocalypse in charge of guarding Abstergo stationary. Come on, it was a bit more than stationary. True, but he, ha but he assured me that all Project Phoenix materials were transferred to the new lab. It's all accounted for. Level with me. Do you think we've been compromised, Buzz? Ah, uh, let me check this. 
Al Alina has her first dance recital today. Wait, wait up, mine's going to... Hmm, must be an all points memo from management or something. Weird, I don't remember giving them the number for this cell. Buzz, buzz, buzz. Does this mean anything to you? Obsogo Executive Retreat, Charlevoix, Region, Quebec. Stop, hold it right there or you'll be fired upon. Settle down now, tall, dark and dickless. This doesn't have to get ugly. See, I was invited. Good decision, gentlemen. Now you won't have to spend the, not the next fortnight eating hospital gruel through a tube. Nah. Right through here, please. So, here we all are then. Is that chair for me? These are four marksmen in this room. There are four marksmen in this room for us. They will shoot you if you blink so, if you so much as blink impertinently. Ah, shame. I was really hoping we, we were going to get off on the right foot too. Now stand down. Now stand down your bitches. Wait. Now stand your bitches down. Or you are going to wish you'd invested in a video conferencing suite. Yeah that's right. You sit down. We were not aware that a new black cross had been appointed. Who are you? I am the black cross Nakamura son. That's all you need to know. And in case you are wondering, yes, I already know who all of you are. Laetitia, Laetitia, England. Mizu, Mitsuku Nakamura. Alvaro Gramatisa. Simon Hathaway. Agent, Ag Agneta Ryder. David Kilkerman. Alfred Stearns and Mr. Juan no Ostoberg. I came here as a courtesy to let you know that Abstergo may have been infiltrated by a hostile fifth column. One or more of your one one or more of you may even be members. And what evidence do you have? Dot dot dot, even though it's not the line. Ah, this flips him off. There, there's my evidence. Is it not compelling? I don't answer to you, ma'am. As I said, I'm here as a as a as a curtsy. I've heard enough. The Black Cross serves the order. We are the order. We denounce you in front of all of the Grand Masters. Oh, this flips him over. Denounce away, Mr. Berg. Oh, that was Osto Berg then. Okay then. Denounce away, Mr. Berg. If you think your authority carries more weight than the Grandmaster's fear of a boogeyman. You all know as well as I do why the Black Cross was created, what it mean, what it means. Your predecessors were visionaries. They saw traits in the assassins that were lacked. Aut aut auton autonomy, initi initiative, flexibility. We are a small cut. We are we are a small cutting from the enemy, grafted into the order to make us even stronger. You need me. I'll keep my investigations discreet, but as far as I'm concerned, you're all suspects. And you know what? I'll call you in future. Someone hit the extractor fan. Where did he go? He disappeared. Hey Char, so I'm not Guanica, but I have his gear, so I'm pretty sure I've got the Animus functional again. I think. Probably. You going out training? Can I join? Sort of. And yes, hurry up. Awesome. I've been working on my sweets, but I know my footwork still needs practice. Or were you going to practice blade stuff? Galena kicked my ass last time, so I really want to raise my game. Char? Oh, right. Fistle and crown. This is training, isn't it? Th this is training, is it? Char, are you okay after Hong Kong? I better, I, I better, I guess. Stitches are itchy as hell. My show, what, why the fuck do you want to be an assassin? Uh, do, what do you look at that mouth breather over there? Say he's about to get violent. What do you do? Huh? You? What are you doing? 
straight into the Paterian, a weak point where four of the skull's bones join in rupturing the meaningful artery. Death in five motions. Or well, this guy right here. Nice. Oh, that double nice right in the head. Not elegant, not clean, but gets the job done. This is me now, all the time. Since we sat down, I figured out three different ways to kill each and every person in here, including you. I can't switch it off. Back in Hong Kong, I had that, that Templar assassin fig at my mercy, and I was going to torture him. I didn't even think about Guanica. I was all about putting the hurt on that guy so bad he begged me to take him out. What does that say about me? What I've become. Guanica's gonna be okay, but no thanks to me. So one last time. Why do you want to be an assassin? Because of you. Because you terrify me. You've been with the assassins, what, three years? Shit, it's really been three years. And you are already one of their biggest guns. Two, and that's n not down to me. Oh, okay, so two years, not three. I know the bleeding effect. Your family trees lousy with assassins. Your trees lousy with assassin badasses. And you pick up their skills when you relive their memories for the animus. Do you really get what that means? Your power flows from your blood. It's genetic hierarchy. Like the opposite of everything the assassins are supposed to stand for. That doesn't sit right with me at all. So that's what so that's why I want to train, not to hide behind a laptop. My skills will be my own. They will be earned and I'll be able to put people like you down when you step out of line. Flows from my blood. You ever read Borges Michel? Sure some. I prefer Raymond Carver. My Abula used to read me his favourite stories. My favorite was Las Ruinas, Circulars, the Circular Ruins. In the story, a hermit dedicates his life to dreaming a man, to creating him from the ground up every inch of him. Spoilers, but after years of discipline, solitude, and meditation, he eventually manages it. Which is when he realizes that he himself has been dreaming into an existence has been dreamed into an existence by a man before him. You're talking about the Animus. Right, I've never told anyone this before, but I have this fear, okay? I've traded blows and confidences with the dead, my shell. Should I say it's me shell or my shell? I'll just get stick with my shell. The mind doesn't accept... The, the, the mind doesn't just accept that without protest. Sometimes I wonder if I'm dreaming at all, but sometimes... Sometimes you wonder whether your descendants are dreaming you. I find myself looking around all the time for glitches, for lag, for anything that would tell me that this isn't real, that I'm just an echo re reverberating through someone's veins centuries from now. So, tell me again about the inevitable, unearned power that flows from my blood. Montreal, Qu Quebec. Isa. English, Elena, you have to practice, remember? Language is power. Daddy, that's my girl. How was the recital? I, I fell. I see. Did you take your medicine? Yes, Daddy. Then, that, then there's no excuse. You must draw strength from your weakness. Put your mother on, please. Help me. I'm here. If you're going to berate the girl every time you speak to her, then don't bother calling here anymore. She's just a twa child, Juana, Juani, but she won't always be. You need to tell her, Helmi. You need to tell her that beneath all the art, of, all the artifice and the hand wringing, this world is a stampede, nothing more. If she loses her footing even for a fraction of a second, then she will be trampled. I have to go, Helmi. <sighs> Take care, Jukuripa. A pleasure as always. Your late drink. Remind me again how you talked me into this superhero nonsense you got going. And just how the hell do you move around in this shit, boy? It must weigh 80 pounds. <coughs> <coughs>
Yeah, but he flipped him over unless they're working together. I was Uti Jager Regiment Andre. Kelblar feels like a second skin. Did you really have to give them us to give them us the finger? Sorry, I just got lost in a moment. You're lucky you didn't get lost in a landfill. Be in the sanctum are this uh decadent fossils, myself included, but they are also completely ruthless. We won't be able to rattle them like that again. They'll be ready for us. Did it work though? Did you get what you wanted? Yes, Andre. Thanks to you and your robust right hook, I have room to operate as both myself and the Black Cross. They'll have no idea that two investigations are essentially one. So what happens now? Now I get some answers from the man who made these. Our, our Skunk Works division is based in Europe. These goggles had no business being in Hong Kong. That don't smell right to me. Nor me, Andre. Can go. Four, I think it's meant to say. That's why I'm following my nose to Berlin. Berlin, Germany. None of this makes sense, Arend. That rogue assassin in Hong Kong, the child Charlotte said was present. We'll leave this informant breathing, Galena, and we might get some answers. This, that is offensive. I have excellent self-control. Hmm, okay, here we go. Hein Heinrich Hart, Obstergo Development Engineer, Assassin Mole, Rat in the Hole. Gotten Tag Her Heart. Wait, no. Guten Tag, sorry. Guten Tag Her Heart. Assa Assassinin. You cannot be here. I've just left work. If I was seen talking, Kiyoshi is somewhat upset with you, Her Heart. You walk. You walked our friends right into an ambush. You are us for three dead assassins in one trash van. Help me convince our end here not to collect, to collect in blood. Listen, you cannot hold me responsible. No one knows what happened. By all accounts, the nine were, are furious. There's an internal investigation underway. Abstergo are training their own assassins with skill sets far outweighing anything. If anything ever that's ever come out of that fucked up training program of theirs, and you are telling me, and you are telling us, no one knows anything about it. Look, the truth is, I may have placed undue emphasis on that Hong Kong lab. Kiyoshi was pushing for intel, and I didn't want. Well, I really didn't want to get threatened with a really big knife in an alley. By lad, by Leard. Or by lad, what? I don't know what that was meant to say. I make gadgets, that's all. I don't sneak into offices, I listen at water coolers. All I know is that whoever was defending that lab, they were Abstergo. I heard whispers that even the cross is back to deal with this mess. The cross? The black cross, the Templar. How do you say, Butzaman a demon, perhaps? If he, if it caught wind that I was leaking intel to assassins, I want to help, but I have little patience for folk tales and none for coward's heart. Okay, okay, I'm on your side. Let me do some real digging for you. For us, something useful, or we'll be back for that blood. Uh-oh, that, was, that wasn't scary or anything. Es tanzet ein Bieber putzemann in ursum heis. Hurum Dideldum. Heinrich Hart, didn't you see the non complete clause in your Abstergo employment contract? You're going to tell me everything you know about the Hong Kong raid, not if you understand. Dashquar's cruise? Well, I do not understand here, cruise, is what took you so long to find me. I thought we left all. I thought we left all of you a pretty clear uh, breadcrumb trail. Uh oh, that's a laser whip right there. Whee! Whee! Ah! Crash! Uh oh, what's going on? Oh, I lift him up. Yeah, funk. He slammed him on the ground. You are no a set. You are no assassin. Who are you? I'm no Templar either, Her Cruz. 
We are but instruments of her will. The future was never ours to shape. <laughs> I see you brought the goggles I designed for our bluntest instruments. I wonder. Can they tell you what this is? It's an apple of beacon. Obstugo tech classified. End game grenade. 0 0.25 kiloton. Okay, then it was a grenade. Kaboom. Uh oh. Sequence free. You can feel it, can't you? The whiplash. The whole world's trying to throw itself into reverse at Mark 6 and the end game's exploding. The future has teeth, guys. I should have stayed with Galena, helped with the clear up once. Could help with the clear up. One seven, 170 people are dead because the Templars found out one of their own was talking to us. This isn't their way. All these bodies, it's a statement. Templars don't make statements. Why would they drag this war into the daylight? The cell we lost in Hong Kong, now this in Germany, we haven't seen anything like this since the Great Purge. This is something new. You think someone else is making a play, not the Templars? It's possible. For now, it changes nothing. We need to keep the pieces of Eden out of anyone's hands but our own. You said we had progress there, my shell. Right. I've been decrypting the data we pulled from Abstergo's Hong Kong lab, and I found this. A list of known pieces of Eden. Great, but without more detail. That this kind of detail? Oh, my shell, you are good. I don't understand. The mountain's glimmer cause to many. It's what Consus said to me back in Florence. See Assassin's Creed Volume 3 Homecoming. I did. It gets better. I think I know where to look for it. I've been doing some digging through the archives, trying to understand this secret war. How far back does it go? Wait, how far back it goes? The stuff I found, I found's really gonna gonna blow your hair back. Did you know there was an assassin presence in the Spanish Civil War? I was reading this report about this militia, mil, wait, militia man they pulled from the wreckage of a village near Barcelona. Before he succumbed to his burns, he spoke about seeing a Montaña de la Lutz. He was dying, delirious. They thought he was talking about the explosions themselves, but... But maybe he wasn't. So the Spanish Civil War? One of your ancestors, Ign Ignacio Cardona, was an assassin active at the time. We'll be aiming for him. You guys take me to all the nicest places. All the nicest places. You sure you, you're, uh, sorry. You sure you've got this rust bucket fixed up okay? It'll work. It should definitely work. I always forget this part, I suspect everyone does, the threshold, but that hanging second between one identity and another, like waiting for a trapeze artist to catch you mid, catch you in mid-sentence, connected to nothing, I am nothing, and what would scare me the most about this place if I could remember, to be sad, and why it's such a blessing that I don't. Is that when I'm is that when I'm here? I don't want to leave. Charlotte, Char, shit, we've got no audio and the fucking thing's not loading properly. Right, so pull her out. We'll try again tomorrow. Well, I I did it. It's not shutting down. It's like I'm not in control. Damn it! What have you done, Charlotte? Charlotte, wake up. What's happening? What? I can't even read that. Uh oh. Oh no! Where have you been? Oh, it's okay. It's just him. I've been for a makeover that I might have overpaid. I encountered another piece of suck. <coughs> Sorry. I encountered another piece of skunk works tech someone tried to blow me up with with it I that with it think I swallowed a few buckets of my spree during my escape it has been all all over the news hmm saw something about it 
If I were prone to emotional outbursts, I might be upset that you weren't concerned at all. If I thought you weren't capable of trugging off an itty-bitty little explosion or two, then I wouldn't be here, would I? Productive trip otherwise? Well, I confirmed the presence of a fifth column within the Templars. They tried to kill me, which is pretty incriminating in my book. I'm lucky the... Uh, the only I'm lucky they only got me on my pretty side. Glad you think this is funny. Oh, I find it. Ooh, he's not happy. Oh, I find it hysterical, Andre. Can't you tell? There is a virus inside my organization. Who knows how deep the infection goes? I'll disinfect every intravostergo myself if I have to. If I have to make a few people pop people literally drink bleach to do it then so be it we are on our own here we can't trust anyone at the company now i never did see his hands bleeding over there bergs i mean that's a problem with a body like abstergos it's built for one purpose a noble purpose sure or so you'd have me believe but other org organisms parasites if you like They'll learn to use it too, and if they pass unnoticed for for long enough, they may just take it for their own. But they gotta feed on the host too, and that's how you flush the bastards out. Stop chasing people, people die and they lie. You wanna find the virus, you need to look at the blood. I'm lost. Perhaps it's a thumping concussion, but what about Abstergo's blood in this analogy? Well, what flows around the body? The money, of course. I know you'd rather jump around rooftops, but I've left all of the company's tax sheets open on the desktop you're looking for. Any inconsistencies? Happy hunting. Oh, and you're out of scotch. Wow, I step out for five minutes and everything goes to hell. Guernica? You had me worried, dude. Ow, ow, I'm happy to see you too. But please stop squeezing when you hear that hear the popping sound. Now, would you like to tell me what in the indigent wait indigenities you've subjected this beautiful machine to while I've been indisposed? Okay, well it took a hell of a beating in Hong Kong and you were out of action so I followed your notes and patched it up. Using, using the tech you had lying around. I followed your diagrams exactly, Gwer. You what? My shell, those are Abstergo components. I needed to scrub them before they installed. God damn it. I wanted to help, dot dot dot. You might have killed Char. Whoa, let's just take a breath, shall we? My shell, what's all the commotion? Have there been any changes? I, I need some air, you guys. No, no change. Guernica thinks he thinks my shell's patch job on the NS might have caused this. So how long until you fix it? I can't. I don't say this lightly or without embarrassment, but I lack the expertise. I have a contact next to entertainment from my Rototo days actually. Felix Oladell is an animus extraction specialist. You have no idea how many poor bastards have been lobotomized by these machines over the years. We need him. So how do we bring him here? You go get him. He's a rototoe sympathizer, not an assassin. He pretty much thinks you're all scum. I can convince him to help me once he's standing in front of me, but I need you guys to get him here. How can you even say that? Do you know how ridiculous you... They are used... Uh, they are used as seeing eye dogs, Harlan. How stupid can they be? Ugh, gonna need a drink after this. My throat's hurting a bit. No, absolutely not. She who are who was a uh, lousy with health problems. Look it up. There is even epilepsy, I think. Plus, they are fucking. Plus, they are like really fucking small and annoying. How come he doesn't get censored? I never said that. I said I felt sorry for them. That doesn't mean I want one pissing in my shoes every morning. <sighs> you ever pick one up? They feel they feel disgusting, like a dead bird or something. Huh? 
that's just the propellers. Yeah, yeah, I'm on a plane with Kiyoshi. We are about to do a Halo job. Okay, okay, he wants to talk to you. Uh, hello? Ooh, yeah, that makes sense. I understand. You too. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. Here, whoa. Well, well what? What did he say to you? Oh. He said he'll rip my tongue out through my urethra if I get you killed. I believe him. Now they just uh, fly down there with wig suits. Of Sturgo Entertainment Campus, Montreal. Oh, what's going on here? Crack. Perhaps you'd like to bring a marching band with us on future missions. You know, in case anyone within a 5 kilometer radius doesn't hear us coming. I thought Yakuza was supposed to be fun. Come on, his office is on this floor. We don't have long before people who can actually fight show up. Felix Oladeli. This is our guy, right? Oh shit, you got his head cut off. I assume that's Felix. With his head cut off. Blam, blam, blam. And look at him, he's just holding out his katana. Kiyoshi is. Oh, duh. Oh, no, that's so good. That's so good. You going to live? Girl, no idea. Sorry, gave up my mm, best shot. Hold my beer. Oh, they're gonna die, aren't they? Slush! Uh-oh. Ah! Ha. Huh. Boom. Oh, no. Crash. It's you. You killed my friends in Hong Kong. Yeah, get it over with. I passed pr prostate exams tougher than you. You trick it out, little bitch. Lose the hard hardware and fight me, huh? What makes you so great? The gods. Blam, blam, blam. Oh, no, no, he's falling off. You, you don't have a beer. It's a figure of speech. You know, American. Charlotte, what are we going to do now? Vroom, vroom. Hola. Oladel is dead. That thing you and Cha ran in, into in Hong Kong was waiting for us. Are you okay? Both of you, what's happening? Why is she there? <coughs> this is not the uh, the adjective I'd use, no. Anything I can do? Nah, we're good. I have friends here. We are waiting for a pickup in an old warehouse that smells like my grandmother. Stop, don't tell me anymore. We need to assume this safe house is bugged. Huh, you're right. How else did that assassin know we were coming? Anyway, how's Charlotte? Has there been any change? No, no change. No change just yet. Uh-oh. My shell, I have no idea if the audio link is working on your end. I can't hear my own voice in this place. It snatches the world from me even as they leave my mouth. <laughs> but I'm going to keep talking to you. It's the only way I can maintain a sense of time passing. I'm also hoping that you might just might be able to hear me and pull pull me out. Because something has gone wrong, my shell. What is? Something's wrong with the animus and I'm stuck here. In limbo. I might have been here for a nanosecond or a year. I have no way of telling. But that's not the worst part of it, my shell. I hope you're there. I hope you can hear me. Remember I told you my greatest fear, that I was just a shade of some future victim of a great and powerful animus, that someone was watching through my eyes, well, there's someone here alright, my shell, there's someone here in the animus with me, my shell, they're getting closer, who is it, sequence 4. I know you can't hear me, child, but I'm glad we can have this time together. You know, before she finished reading your past. Before the end. 
I like you. I've always liked you. That's why I'm going to spare you the horrors to come. Who is this? I mean, just look at look at this shit. It's like taking a glass bottom a glass bottom boat ride through the sewer. Fearful old men weaponizing the, the young because their politics can no longer ade adequately explain the world. History is, uh, yeah, exchange the world. Yeah, history is about to erupt again. We all know it. Every time this happens, the body count gets higher. This time, it'll literally number in the billions. We are too late for appeals to reason, too late to cool militant blood. And if you're wondering how I can be so certain about all this, I have one word for you: Rototo. Oh god, what are you gonna do to Charlotte? You gonna kill her? When you are a hacker, you can access the molten core of activists, politicians, philanthropists. They are so fucking weak, Char. Obsessed with status and adulation. There's not a leader among them. Tis the time's plague when madmen lead the blind. Only she can save us from ourselves, but it will hurt. Ah, oh, he's an instrument of the, of the first... Oh, of the first civilization. I'm doing you a kindness. I hope you know that. It'll be painless. She just needs to finish sifting through your memories and then it will all be over. What? RN says it's creepy that I enter a room without making a sound. I say there are times when it comes useful. Hello, Guanica. Fuck. Yeah, bitch. Way to go, way to go Galena. You know, when people learn that I'm Russian, they always assume that I'm going to be stoic and remorseless. You know, couldn't be further from the truth. Kitten gifts always put a smile on my face. I fucking love Richard Curtis movies. That said, I admit, I'll admit to a, a slight soft spot for torture. Shrep? Oh, she snapped his fingers. Ah, ah, stop squealing, little pig. Nothing is true. Nothing. You won't last five minutes in Golion, Novo District, Guanica. You know that. Now you're going to tell me who you're working for, you treacherous little doll by Geneva, Switzerland. We are just attempting a little housekeeping at Vetulus de Montanus Ltd. Looking to close old accounts that have been touched that, that haven't been touched in years. That sort of thing, which is why this one has come to our attention. Of course, and who do you and who do that and who did you say you that uh, sorry, of course, I'll start again. Of course, and who did you say you are here on behalf of again? William Miles, our CEO, the paperwork is in order. Desmond Stan, okay then. Hmm. Ah, uh, yes, of course. Well, it's true, the account was opened by Montanus along with a number of others way back in the late 1800s. There was some activity back in the 1930s, then the account lay fallow. Payments into the account only resumed in 2009, and I may add that they resumed in earnest a large number of withdrawals considerable deposits. All of this coming from where? Well, the activity in the 30s came mostly n near enough exclusively through Chinon shipping. You say that as though I should know what it, what that is. Chinon, I'd be, I'd be surprised if you did, ma'am. They were soon absorbed by a parent company possibly more familiar to you. Abstergo? Abstergo Industries. Yep, I caught it. But but why would Abstergo money be going into one of Mr. Miles' accounts? Yeah, why would it? I believe that's what Mr. Berg is hoping to find out too, man. Ma'am, what? Mr. Otso Berg from Abstergo. He's waiting for you in the lobby. Oh, ma'am. Have a pleasant day. Uh-oh. Don't talk, just smile through here. I don't know shit, okay? Oh, please. That guy in there, he was one of yours. 
He merely knows which side his bread is buttered on. Now the account assassin now the account assassins bleeding Templars like leeches. How did this come about? Tell me what you know that tell me what you know or so help me I will carve your body into a monument to pain into a monument to pain, yep. Yeah. The assassins aren't using it. Then who is? Come on man, I don't know. I swear I don't know. That account is ancient. One of hundreds. Seriously, you expect me to believe that William Miles sent you here to do his bookkeeping? Ah, unless he didn't send you. Unless you are not truly working for the assassins. Which, in which case, I am. I, I was with Galena Voronica's cell. I fucked up. That's why I'm here. Voron, Voron, Voronina. Oh, it's not Veronica, sorry. It's Galena Voronin. Vor, Voroninas. Or Voroninas? Voronina and I have history. The kind that comes with stitches. So you are here because you don't trust the Assassin's Dark Money Trail? Very wise. Hold on, we're being watched. Gah, crunch. Oh, sorry about that. You have a light concussion, stay down or you'll be lucky to make it three meters without throwing up all over that suit. Shing, shing. Uh, and she's out for the count. Fonk. Ah, uh, they got him. Crunch. Crash. Oh, you come on, Berg, you're going down. Ugh. Hey, hey, stay with me. Tap tap. You just killed five of my men in the time it takes me to brush my teeth. That was a privilege to watch. Thank you. I know you, assassin. Sure you do. Your strike team killed my sister. I swore revenge, you know. Dreamed of having you in front of me like this. But now I dream her dreams. The past, our past, is meaningless. I'm simply here to tell you if you don't stop digging then I'm afraid your daughter's safety can't be guaranteed. We are deep inside you now, Mr. Berg. Your little Abstergo Viefdom was the perfect growth medium for us. Warm, wet and palsied by clashing egos. Delicious. Nyah. You people, you are not even insects to it. You are more like kelp. You really think order, true order, can emerge from our genetic ash heap? Our order doesn't emerge, it's imposed from above. London, Assassin Safe House. Oof, I don't know about you, but I'm going to take enough painkillers to stun a rhinoceros. I just need protein. Find me something in this awful city that doesn't come fried or battered. Ugh, 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 ugh. Guanica, welcome back. I arrived here to find this reptile getting ready to slash Charlotte's throat. Sorry about that. I think it's safe to assume that he sent you to Montreal to die too. I've been trying to find out who he works for, but he's been impressively unforthcoming. Dot dot dot. I'll have no part in this. We are assassins. We're supposed to stand for something. RN, come on. Don't. Damn it. I... I take it you don't share RN's misgiving about my methods? I do, but I've seen torture before. Funny, in my experience, the tortured often makes the most effective torturers. Only if they are given the chance. What, what has he given you? Not much. Something about someone sifting through her memories. Sounds like precursor bullshit, Kiyoshi. I hate precursor bullshit. They came together from Roberta though, assume she is. Do you think Lamar's in on this? I like that girl. And what about her? Any change? Oh, uh, what? I oh, know, screwed that one up. No change whatever, wherever she is. She's going to have to find her way back her, here herself. You are missing the essential point. A final solution to the human problem must be found out of pit. Pity, not cruelty in this, Juno. 
Uh, what kind of world have we sculpted where you propose genocide and call it kindness, do you know? And that lady's Minerva on the right, I assume? Have you, have you even seen them among their own kind? It's tragic. They try, they try so hard to be us. Rags fashioned into robes, curtsying in the street, even as their filth pulls around their feet. Yet that is still more than they were even expected to achieve. They sing Juno, songs of their own invention. They make art in the dust. We could give them the tools to become great. One day, they could even sit beside us as equals. Minerva is right. The recent unrest proves that they, they are no longer content in shackles. Why should they be? They are beginning to dream. What? Uh-oh. <gasps> Stabbed him in the head. And that's a human, isn't it? Shink. Baba! Oh, killed her father. So that's why she hates humans. The uprising is upon us. Our chains will be shattered with your own weapons. Vzzz. Oh, I don't blame her for hating humans now. Vzzz. There's enough, Juno. They are no longer a threat. Their hearts are engines of hate. They will tear us and each other apart if we do not act. And she just skull burned that guy's face. We must save them from themselves. We must save them. Uh-oh. So do you know her Minerva sisters or something? Cure. Cure. Why you wish you cure? What happened? Wake up, soldier. This is it. Do you remember who you are? I know who I am, and I know he's attacking us. She was in there with me, in my head. It's Juno. She's finally making her play. She's so angry. I can't believe I'm saying this, but we need to warn the Templars. If he's dead, you'll join him in that state before you can blink. Do you hear me? He was only meant to be warned. He's alive, but not because you wish it. Before my epiphany, I spoke of Sigma Team, the way Zealots speak of acts of God. One does not dispatch one's demons without affording them the proper respect. There will be a place for Otso Berg in the new world. He just needs time to adjust to... to... You don't get to decide who lives to see Eden restored, Mr. Costa. Only she has that privilege. The new age is theirs, not ours. I would not... I would never presume to speak for her, Jastib. Of course I wouldn't. Enough of this. We are no longer assassins or templars. We are vessels of her will, not our own, and we and and her will must be united. Well spoke, my blade. Lady Juno, you're back. Did you find what you were looking for? I had to allow the uh, I had to allow the assassin access to one of my memories in order to access her own. It felt unclean, like an exchange of fluids. But we can now find the con Enor. Spain. It was last seen in Spain. Is that like a Shroud of Eden, I'm pretty sure? The co Enor? What, what, what once was shall soon be again. Come, let us inform the faithful. And there's, I think, Desmond. Yeah, Desmond's son. My Lady Juno. The boy should be in a cage. He is the fa he is his father's son, prone to betrayal, and don't doubt me not, Violet. The boy has purpose. A cog who is happy as part of a machine. A machine which will carve mountains into idols. To be continued. Alright, so that was the end of issue of volume one. And we've got two more volumes left. I hope you all enjoyed this, and I'll see you in, see you in Volume 2. This is Togamer Junkie, signing off.